Hey, we'll see. To to each his own. But next divisional game, we got the Baltimore Ravens at the Buffalo Bills, which I think Oof, Bills are looking. Bills are looking, looking, looking pretty legit out here in these streets, man. It, it's it's you, you know this Josh Allen has not shown a speck of of not being anything outside of all pro quarterback this season. You and then you and then you and then you put an all pro wide receiver in his lap, and then you accompany it with a defense that's that's I mean they 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 got everything you need from a from a serious Super Bowl contender. The Bills have now the Ravens got over that hump. Lamar Jackson got over that hump, but I mean the in my opinion the Bills are and the Ravens are a good team. But in my opinion the Bills are better than the Ravens. So I'm. And at at Buffalo too, man. Hey, really quick, guys. You see? Did you guys see Vonkowski's comment? It says uh, the Dolphins have resources. <laughs> we we I gonna get to the know. Dolphins. We we definitely gonna get to the Dolphins. <laughs> mm. I, 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 we we definitely gonna get to the Dolphins. <laughs> That's hilarious. We do so, have resources though. So I'm, I'm assuming I'm assuming you're going with the Bills have it. Yeah, one hundred percent. Thanks. Well, <laughs> isn't this the game of two quarterbacks that you said weren't good quarterbacks? Hey, Lamar still ain't a good quarterback. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Keep your mouth shut. Keep your what mouth you mean? shut. Keep like I, like I asked, like I asked, like I asked Freeze on Monday, was he concerned when Lamar threw that pick? He said, "You damn right he was." I'm pretty sure most of the Baltimore Ravens fan base was concerned. Mm-hmm. So, so Lamar yeah, yeah. won this football okay game with his legs, right. but it's okay though. It's okay. It's okay hey, to say I was right, bro. That's all I'm trying to good, tell King you. Mel. It's okay to say I was right. That's all I'm saying. What you what you write about? He won the I game. I told with his you legs. Josh Allen was gonna be that dude. I told you that. Wow, you got one right. By the way, I'm still <laughs> waiting for Dak Prescott to get that contract. <laughs> oh, it's coming after this season. You best believe it's coming. Yeah, anyway. a one year deal, six million. Talk, yeah. talk. <laughs> they, listen, okay. they franchise Dak again. That's another twenty five million in the bank. They're not franchising that dude, man. They gotta sign him. They gotta sign who, him. Who? Who gotta, gotta sign him? Gotta sign him. We we gonna say this for a different pod. Yeah, let, yeah, me, let, let me know what you think about these, these Ravens and Bills. Pod. We'll go there off season. But yeah. anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, big ups to uh, both of these quarterbacks, man. I'm a big fan of both of these guys. I love Lamar Jackson. I love Josh Allen. Uh, what's up, King Mill? Uh, Appreciate you coming through. I really don't know who to pick in this game. I honestly don't. The 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 hot hand is saying take a ride on the Buffalo Bills and just continue your way through the season. Buffalo is looking very unstoppable. Their defense is clicking, and then the backside says Lamar Jackson's coming to town. Um, so, and the way that Baltimore has been looking the last few weeks, uh, especially that running game has picked up the smoke again. It got the juice, and uh, we saw last year uh, what happens when that run game for the Raven clicks the way it does. It is very very difficult to stop. Uh, Lamar Jackson had another 100-yard playoff rushing game. Um, and he finally got his first playoff win, which I'm so proud of him. Uh, he, he finally got that 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 much-needed uh, win. I'm sure they took the monkey off his back. So now, nah, guess what? He can, t- he can just really relax now. He can just come out there and just play ball. Uh, so, my pick, uh, I'm going to go with the Ravens. Uh, I'm going ri- to ride with Lamar. And say that the Ravens are going to upset the Buffalo Bills um, in a close game. I'll say like around. I mean, both teams could put up thirty, so we'll say like 34, 31, maybe like a close shootout. The Buffalo Bills' rush defense is a little concerning to me. Did you see the Ravens' defense this week? Last mm-hmm. week, they they took care of business. I feel like they were trying to force feed Derrick Henry in that Probably. game. They should have. They should have put the ball in Tannehill's hands a little bit more. But but but, that, but, but that's their. I mean, that that that's their game plan though. Put the ball in Derrick. You, you gonna live or die by Derrick Henry. That's that's, un, that's understandable. But you still gotta adapt to the game. Like they were selling out to stop Derrick Henry and AJ Brown was killing 
Humphrey during the course of that game. They was getting the tight ends involved with Ferkser. Mm. AJ so, nice. Yeah, so by them sell, trying to sell out to stop Derrick Henry, they should have set up the play action a little bit more. They should end up spreading spreading out the receivers a little bit more. So I'm well, going to be go. honest, though. Be honest, because I, we, 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 we predicate this podcast. That's that's one of the main things that we said we wanted this podcast to be when we when we discussed it years ago. In the Twitter chat, you blame this loss specifically on one person. I would like for you to acknowledge who that person was. Vrabel. <laughs> you lying ass <laughs> <laughs> I I did say did I say Vrabel have it? No, no. Do I need to bring up the Vrabel. chat? Do I need to bring up the chat? Bring it up. Bro, it's too many messages to go back and bring it up. No, you did not say anything about Mike Vrabel. You blamed that loss on Ryan Tannehill. I put it on Talk Brady. about Ryan Tannehill, and you said it was his fault that he lost that game. I just want to hear you say it. That's all I want to hear you do. And then we can move on to the next topic. I just want to hear you say it was Ryan Tannehill's fault. Because well, in my opinion, it was. Well, I'm going I'm to put it 70-30. Vrabel, 70. Tannehill, 30. <laughs> hey, boy. Hey, you be tucking your tail between your legs, boy. Listen, man, <laughs> I never thought I would see the day. You be running, man. You be How running, I run? Bro. It's 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 Vrabel's fault too. I'm not gonna put 110 on Ryan Tannehill because, like the I said, yeah. the, the play calling. You the first drive of the game, you would drive it down the field by throwing the football. Now you want to just because Derrick Henry has a tip of change him on the sideline, we want to get we want to hand the ball up to Derrick Henry all the time, and we coming down to what two straight three and outs, and we going into the fourth quarter. The Baltimore Ravens taking the lead. Mm. True. I think they I think they're at a point now where they you know they know they know that you know Derek Harry but you know butters the bread but you, you can trust Tannehill in those situations to uh to do something at this point in his career. I mean he's shown that he can you know he ain't just a he's a he ain't just a a, a dude anymore, right? Like he can he's been he's ball a, in the past few he's seasons. He's a bad so. boy. He threw thirty three <laughs> touchdowns and seven interceptions or something like that. So yeah. he's playing Bake, this is gonna hurt Bake's feelings. He's playing like a top five quarterback right now. Who? You heard, you heard me, Ryan Tannehill. You mean like top oh, five? I said that hurt my feelings. I gave him, I gave him, I gave him props two weeks ago. I said that Ryan Tannehill's playing the best ball of the year. He should have been. Yeah, but you ain't put him in the top five though. Oh, Ryan Tannehill has to be in the top five this year. He has the stats to back it up. I mean, he should have been top in the five. Oh, we had, we didn't we didn't do a top five this year, so we definitely gonna be doing a top five sometime in the near future. Yeah, yeah, Tiny Hill will probably yeah. be in there depending on how I'm feeling that day. 